Hello, and welcome to Basically Blood Bowl. And, as expected, we saw the reveal of the third, and realistically, final Chaos Dwarf star player. So, let's take a look at him. Now, as predicted, the Monday model was that of Zarg Madai, blunderbuss wielding star player for the Chorfs. And it's another home run for the design team. The model looks fantastic, the face portraying the madness, the lone oversized eye, the design of the gun with its shape and the little dial on the side, it's ridiculously blood bowl. And the paint job on this one is great too. That smoke blast as the ball and various nuts and bolts shrapnel is propelled out, it's brilliant. He seems to be standing on a substitute for a tactical rock, what looks like a dwarven helm, but I could be wrong. Let me know if you think it's something else. But all in all, like the rest of the Chaos Dwarves reveals, it's incredible. So, what do we learn from the article? Well, there isn't much of a backstory for poor old Mad Eye. We'll have to wait on the spike release for that. But what we do learn is that Zarg can not only fire the ball, but also blast his opponents too, with his special rule. Then I started blasting which reads as follows. Once per half, at the start of his activation, Zarg may perform a blunderbuss blast special action. When he does, select a standing opposition player within three squares of Zarg and roll a d6. On a three plus, the selected player is hit. Immediately make an unmodified armor roll and subsequent injury roll if necessary against the selected player. On a two, the opposing coach selects a player from either team, but of course not Zarg, within three squares of the originally selected player to be hit instead. And on a 1, Zarg is hit instead. If the armour of the player hit is not broken, nothing happens. This is a great rule, as it allows Zarg to target opponents to clear a space for a runner or take out a player in defensive support, and all from three spaces away. It's a shame that it's a once per half action, as I fully expect Zarg to have a secret weapon, which may hinder his chances of being there for later carnage, but I may be wrong. The jeopardy of a roll of 1 or 2 is great too especially with the opponent being able to target one of your teammates if the dice rolls go against you. What we do know is that Zarg will have the skills Hail Mary Pass, Cannoneer and Nerves of Steel and will have a passing ability of 3+, plus. so he's equally as strong as a quarterback for any Chorf or Badlands Brawl team. What we don't know is the cost, although we can assume somewhere at or above the 80k mark as per his Dwarven counterpart. Zarg Mad Eye and all the Chaos Dwarf range is due soon, and I wouldn't bet against seeing their preview for release arrive this Sunday. So until then, unless GW has some more surprises, thanks for watching, and it's ciao for now.